It is very easy to run DeepSeq R1 model locally on your computer. I'm going to show you how you can do this. Just Google install Olama. Olama is a tool that we'll be using to run this model. You can select your operating system. I have Windows, so click on download for Windows and it will download it. Once it is downloaded, just double click. This should be a common sense. I have already installed this, so I'm not going to run through the steps, but for you to install it, it it's a very common sense process. And during the installation, if ever it asks you to add a path, the path of Olama into your environment variable, then make sure you add it so that when you go to your Windows command, command prompt and run Olama command, it can run it. So when I run Olama help, you will see a couple of commands. One of the commands we will use is pull. So we are going to pull the DeepSeq R1 model from cloud locally to our computer. Now, let me just go to the home page and you see, click on this. So you, you can go to models here, okay, uh, or search. DeepSeq R1 model comes into various flavors. So the smallest one is 1.5 B. It occupies 1.1 GB, whereas 7 B is 4.7 GB. Uh, as the size increases, the performance of the model will also increase. But based on your computer speed, you can download any of these model. Okay, so just copy this part. So I'm going to show you how do you install the smallest one. Okay, so you will say Olama pull this. I already pulled it. So for me, it did not take much time for you. It will take few seconds, few minutes or whatever. Uh, you can also get this 7B, but since 7B is 4GB, it might take some time. Okay. Once again, I already install it. So for me, it's going to be pretty fast, but make sure you check your computer resources and install it accordingly. Now we can run this. Okay. So let me run the smaller one. So I can say Olama, Olama run that. And now it will run the model locally. So now your data is not going to any cloud, any server, nowhere. It's all running locally. And you can ask questions. Okay. Why is the sky blue? And see, it is doing the inference. So usually the way deep sick model works is, it will have this think prompt, okay? It will think for some time and then it will just uh, produce this output. Okay, you can say, write a four line poem on why <laughs> pizza and salad do not like each other. And it will, see right now, since I'm using 1.5 billion model, it's small model, so it is, faster let me see the poem pizza salad you don't seem to get it that flavors clash okay whatever if you're running higher version 7b model or higher version of the model the output is going to be better okay so this is how you can by the way do control d to exit it again if you want to run it with 7b model you will just say 7b okay and it will do that. Now let me show you how do you do this programmatically. Programmatically, how can I call these models? So let me just show you that. I'm going to show you two ways uh, in which you can call the local model. Number one is Olama, Olama Python module. Okay. So you can install this module by just running pip install olama so go to your command prompt okay and run pip install olama and it will install that the second way is to use langchain so just install langchain okay pip install langchain and then i think you have to install uh chat olama as well but we'll we'll look into that later Okay, now it's just, I'll just copy paste this code, okay? So see, and I don't need 
some of this code so I will just run this and here and you can you can remove this too just specify your model so what is the model once again the model says this okay so this is the model control enter and it will call olama which is running locally so in my computer see here i have olama running locally it should be running otherwise the server olama server should be running behind the scene then it can output the message the other way is lang chain olama so let me show you that i think chat olama right chat olama let me see yeah chat olama is the right module so for this you need to install of course langchain and after you install langchain uh, you can just copy this code okay it's like this code i'm going to copy deep sea carbon and temperature i'm setting it to 0.7 you can use 7.b uh, or 1.5b and then you just say llm dot invoke okay so just say llm dot invoke okay write four line poem on why pizza and salad do not like each other control enter and once again your olama server here should be running it called it and see it got this output now of course you can do a message dot content okay you can print this and you will see that it will always have this think tags where it will show you the reasoning or or how it is thinking about this poem and this is the final output I hope with this video you got a quick understanding on how to run DeepSeq model or any other model okay like it's not just that model like if you just do Olama you can run pretty much any model locally provided that you have resources okay see so if you try to install for example 671b on your local computer which is their most powerful model it will require 404 gigabyte so it might be difficult all right i hope you like this video if you have any questions post in the comment box below